Hey guys, so today we are talking about six ways to wear white denim for summer. What's up guys, welcome back to Gensage. I'm George, this is Blake. If you have not hit that subscribe button yet, hit that right now. We are here every week talking about men's fashion, lifestyle, and today, white denim. We have gotten this question a few different times in a few different video comments that, you know, how do you wear white denim? How do you pull it off? And today we're gonna get down and tell you how to do that. So white denim is something that you don't have to wear a specific time of the year, but for me, white denim is, is like a spring, summer type of feel. I do wear it in the, in the, in the winter, like I said, in the fall. But I think summertime just yields that perfect opportunity, you know? Yes, guys, white denim definitely makes a statement, which is why it's important that it fits yes. really, really well. Because, I mean, if you have blue denim or black denim and then, you know, they're a little long or a little baggy, you know, it's just gonna look average, right? Not bad. But if you have white denim, you're gonna be making such a statement that if it doesn't look almost perfect, people are not gonna, you know, you're not gonna pull it off. Yeah, so, uh, exactly, so the fit has to be on point, you know, looking perfect as far as the fit, that has to be there with white denim. Um, as far as it being crisp, clean, and like brand spanking new, I don't think so. Like, George has had the same pair of white denim for, I wanna say like three years, you know, and like as they age, they, like the color has like kind of changed a little bit, but they're still white, you know, it still has like that. They're a little off-white now. Yeah, but they're cool, you know, like I, I like my white denim, not dirty, but like, you know, worn in. Let's be honest, white denim is going to get messed up, it's gonna get dirty, and you're gonna feel a lot worse about it the more money you spend on it. So, you know, if you go into H&M, buy a pair of, you know, $25, $30 white denim, get them tailored, 10 bucks maybe. So another thing to consider about the fit when you're sporting white denim is that I feel it has to be cropped. Like, there, there should be no break, you know? So even if you are buying that $40 pair of denim, you, you are going to get that $10 tailoring to make sure that they are cropped right at the ankle. Um, if they're not, then I suggest you like rolling them up at least one or two cuffs. Cause I was gonna say, you know, if you wore them with like a Chelsea boot or something, it would work if they're a little bit longer. But if you're going to wear them with sneakers or low top shoes, they gotta be cropped. Yeah, so I own three pair. The ones I'm wearing today are a little bit longer than normal, but I just rolled them up twice. Right. All right guys, so we put together three different looks, each wearing the same pair of white denim, just changed the upper and the sneakers and a few accessories. But basically, we just want to show you how easy it is to style white denim and give you some ideas on how to do it if you're you know, looking to branch out into the white denim category. So pretty much for my first look, I went very neutral. Um, it's almost like white on white, but it's white denim, cream top, and then cream loafers. It's a very simple look, very safe look that I feel anyone could wear. It's typically used during the summer, this specific look, because the short sleeve uh, dress shirt. But you know, it's, it's, I kept the tailoring very, very tight and very fitted because I felt like it had to be like that, you know, Palm Springs, you know, Coachella vibe. And, 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 and I liked it. It worked. So I did similar vibes for my first look. I went with just a Hawaiian shirt, but kind of a toned down Hawaiian shirt. So not too aggressively bold, I guess you would say, but then the white denim kind of made the statement and I just paired it with a clean white sneaker with this blue stripe. And I think this is where the cropness of the denim really comes into play because if these were too long, like my whole leg would just look like a big sea of white. And I think you really need that little crop and that little hint of ankle to kind of break up the look between the shoes. And if, you're, if your white denim is a little longer, I would definitely recommend a darker pair of shoes, like a you know red or a blue or something like that, just to kind of break up the, the look. For my third look, I kind of piggybacked off of George's Hawaiian shirt. I went with also a Hawaiian shirt. Mine is a little bit more bold. It's a, I made the actual shirt the statement piece and I made the white pants more of like subtle. I paired it with boat shoes to give it that like beachy vibe, you know, where this is a total like a uh, Caribbean style, like Miami vibe. It's like vacation. Yeah. Like mine, mine you could get away with in the city and, but I think yours is more like, you gotta be by some water or on vacation. Yeah, yeah, to... I mean, even my Hawaiian shirt is very like flowy. It's not too tight. Um, you know, it's vacation, why not? Exactly guys. So for my second look, I went with kind of, I guess, Ivy League, East Coast kind of vibes with it. So um, I did the white denim, obviously, and then this 70 style polo from Lacoste, but kept it a classic gray, so it's not too 
statement making except for the style of the polo that is a little bit interesting. And then I paired it with some tassel loafers, which I had worn quite a bit. So they're kind of worn in and beat up and they look like, you know, kind of the shoes that you just throw on to go outside and, you know, grab the paper or grab the mail or run run to the grocery store. They're not nice. like- Grab the paper and hey, the loafers, I mean, dude. you know, like I'm, they're very old man vibes, but they're not, they're not crispy and clean because if, if they were, I don't know if they would work with such a casual look. Honestly, when I see this look, I feel like you need like a Porsche and, <laughs> and you should be like, you know, like that guy who's like a doctor, a lawyer, and just like has a week in there and he's going up to Santa Barbara. I mean, it's a cool look. I like it. It's, it's definitely a little outside the box, I would say, but if you have this outfit in your wardrobe, I would give it a shot. All right, guys. And now for my last look, I did more of like, I try to do a city vibe, but with white denim, okay? So it's very different. Uh, I did white denim, white shoes. I did a gray t-shirt and I paired it with this like striped, I guess it's like a t-shirt jacket. It's super light, it's perfect for summer and those chilly summer nights, especially in LA. Um, and it's kind of casual. I pop the collar, I could roll up the sleeves. I mean, this is like super, super, I, I mean, I swear it's like a t-shirt, but I call it a jacket, you know? I mean, it's got a zipper, it looks like a jacket. It's got a zipper, it makes right? sense. I mean, but it's 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 perfect for summer, dude. Yes. Right. I think the jacket alone is like a statement piece. The pants are just like an accessory to it. It's just like a look that you could wear all around the city. And for my last look, guys, I went with something that I think everyone has in their closet. I paired a blue chambray shirt with some white denim, and then some sneakers from Taft. Now I got the brown high tops from Taft. If you have low tops, whatever, any type of clean, casual sneaker will work with this look. But I think the blue and the white denim are like a classic combo that. If you're going to try out a white denim look, this would be the first one I would go with, honestly, personally. Yeah, so. I, think, I think your look is, is a little more elevated in terms of like with the leather sneakers, it gives it more of like a brunch vibe. It's a cool look. For, it's, a, it's a total like dressed up look for summer. Right, and you're not making too many statements that if you know, you're new to white denim, it's not gonna feel that crazy because that's the only thing that's probably new. Like if you wore this outfit with dark denim, it would look great as well. Then it's so. like, if, if you, like if you wore it with white denim, with dark denim, it'd be like a like a bar look. Right, like nighttime. Yeah. So another thing about white denim, guys, is, I mean, you can wear it at night, but it, I would say, you better be wearing that outfit during the day before you yeah. wear it at night. I wouldn't, yeah. I wouldn't straight just get ready at 6 p.m. to wear a white denim look out to the club. No. But if I'm already out, I wouldn't feel really out of place, <laughs> even though no one will know when you got ready. But unless, I mean, you're, now, unless you're on vacation. Or Miami or Vegas. Yeah, keep white denim to the daytime and while the sun is still out. Guys, I hope this was interesting. I hope this was helpful. I hope this gave you some ideas on how to style white denim. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, hit that right now. If you haven't followed us on Instagram, at Jens Lounge, give us a follow over there. Use the hashtag, hashtag Jens Lounge, so we can see your photos that you guys are rocking different looks. And if you are wearing white denim, let us know. Thanks, guys. Cheers.